Hello, welcome back. Uh, we are currently in the most annoying world so far in God of War, in my opinion. Uh, Vanaheim. I really, really dislike it so far, this uh, this part of the story. It's cool to see working... Uh, it's cool to see that um, Kratos and uh, Freya are working together, but it's also so... And just the enemies here, the invulnerability, the hateful fucker. I hate this guy so much, holy fuck. Like, oh my god, way too hard. Um, yeah, but we're gonna continue and see um, how this evolves, um, the story around Freya here on Vanaheim, if we can f uh, free her from her curse. And so far, it seems like that uh, she's starting to understand us, why we act like we did, why we do what we do. And um, there's also a raven somewhere. I'm getting easily distracted. It, start, it seems like she's starting to gain back some, some uh, sympathy towards us. Let's see, because she knows now that we also lost our daughter. Yeah, let's see. Maybe we will gain back uh, her um, goodwill towards us. Here's hoping, right? Here's hoping. That took forever. That's unnecessary. <laughs> oh man, so much unnecessary stuff lately in this world. My guess is the raven, somehow. And some loot, of course. That's a good thing about uh, visual audio. So it's somewhere uh, like... It would be visual sight somewhere over there, but... I can't see it from here, so let's continue. <clears throat> These plants behave similarly to the scorn poles we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago. We need to keep them um, frozen. That's my guess. Like, I bet if I unfreeze it now... Yeah, okay. Well, considering how Spartans are made, it's no wonder you turned out as you did. Your fate was sealed from the start. Fate can be overcome. I used to think so. When the Norns told me of my son's fate, I thought I could change it. You know well how that worked out. The Norns. The fates of these lands. That's right. You defy prophecy at your own peril. Basically, I am the un imbalance that brought Ragnarok. The Trace would agree with you about prophecy. He rushes blindly to a fate the giants foretold. He disappears for two days, trying to prove he is their champion, fabled to fight at Ragnarok. What? I know all the Ragnarok prophecies. There's no champion of the giants. It is one glow concealed. Because of this champion, the realms are saved at Ragnarok. Only Asgard falls, and Odin with it. So all this time... Odin's obsession with every detail of Ragnarok, he's been missing a crucial piece. Oh. Well done, bro. Atreus will not be a pawn of prophecy. You still stand against fate, even with victory foretold. I will not march my son to war. He is no Spartan. I would keep it that way. You would speak to me of protecting your child? Is my tragedy not enough of a lesson? Fighting fate is a waste of the precious time we're given to spend with them. You never know when someone cut it short. Okay, where do I have to go? Ah, further up, of course. Okay. <clears throat> like these uh, parts where I have to press a button to jump upward, those I would like to skip. That's a button too much. <laughs> we found something. The Reckoning. Find a way to cross the broken bridge. Well, it seems like... Oh, look, there's also more um, loot somewhere. There must be a big treasure chest. Treasure. <laughs> Um. Oh. 
fun. One more time, so that we can uh, actually uh, can you swing set that, that on fire. To the other side and burn the bramble blocking your path. That's actually what I'm trying to do. Forgot about this red thing. Us. And there we go. We now we can Let's finally go back. Oh, yeah. Hey, Stephen. Squeamish about war. After all the gods you've killed. I have seen enough war to know the cost. And I don't. After the price I paid to end war. See what happens when you don't fight a true evil. There we go. And like that. And... Hey, more health. I need to find a few more, but more health at some point. All right, now back to the task at hand. Yep. It's so beautiful. I hate this place, but it's beautiful. That's one of Odin's captains. Be ready. Be ready, he says. Okay, another boss fight. Whew. Let's see. Let's see how this goes, guys. All right. Captain, you say, yeah? What a fool. What a fool you were trying to conquer me. Ragnarok will not bring back what you have lost any more than killing me. I am reaching my limit for enlightened platitudes from you today. Can you please just shut up and kill things? <laughs> I guess. I guess we can do that. I heard we are good at that. Shut up! Bum! Do not tell me to kill again. What? I killed to protect my son, to aid my friends. But I will be no one's monster. Never again. You don't get to make that choice. Not with the debt you have. I am not here for debts. I will always have helped you. So much has been taken from me and I'm just supposed to let it all go. Enough. You both are small little childs. <laughs> I wonder why it's easier for her uh, to stay in this form and not be pulled back than if she would not use magic. Let's go. It's just past those doors up ahead. Okay. Ma'am. There. I feel the source of the magic keeping me in Midgard. What is this place? My home. I was born here. Her own home is keeping her from returning home. Oh, that's so fucked up. Hold on. Something's not right. Opinbera. World tree roots bound in Odin's damn knots. That's how he did it. Come on! Nitho! 
Oh. Richard! It belongs to Odin? No. It protects Yggdrasil's roots wherever they are. Bastard was counting on it. Bastard, don't let. Don't let it hide in the realm tear. Just killed the protector of Yggdrasil. Or let's say the balance, the thing that was eating on it. Can't touch that one. Oh. oh wow. Let us do it. It hurts them. For <laughs> she 
she's gaining all of her powers back, right? Oh my god. She's full again. She's whole again. Is it done? Let's see how easily she can kill us now. It's over. It's, it's really over. I'm, I'm happy. You have what you seek. And also afraid. I suppose this is the point where I forgive you. Come with me if you want to live. Or I kill you. Have you decided? <sighs> to kill Odin, come on. Afterwards you can kill him. Either. We're too strong for There's that. Still a part of me <laughs> that is so angry that it'll always be. It'll always be angry. But no. You are not the one who needs to die. Odin does. I do see that. Look. Everything that's happened between us. No need to explain. Not to me. for that brothers and sisters A truce I do not regret saving your life and never will but the choice between life and death should have been yours to make I should not have robbed you of that choice Nidhurk was a powerful enemy, man. Holy crap. Not as powerful as the hateful. But powerful. Oh, loot. Nice. <laughs> uh. What did we find there? An amulet! The amulet is a unique item with, uh, with expandable slots for enchantments. The amulet can be upgraded to unlock more slots. Dude, I'm still in the tutorial, I guess. <laughs> I'm getting more and more items where I was like, hey, here, take this, take this, take this. And by the way, they all do different kinds of shit. All right, cool, cool. Select the amulet. Sure. Let's go there. Press this to uh, check this out. And then we have Midgard's Endurance as an enchantment socket. Um, when an enchantment is selected in the list, the, the description is displayed on the far right of the screen. Press X to select an enchantment and move to the socket list. So press X. Um, wait first. Okay, we have to slot it first. And we have how it started now. And uh, upgrade the amulet at the shop to repair uh, to repair slots. Find enchantment sets to unlock bonus abilities. And the perk one that we have right now 
ist ähm, Midgard, Midgard's Endurance. One out of three. Set, so if we have... It, ah, it reduces the cooldowns. An enchantment of Midgardian Origins that can be slotted in the Amulet of Yggdrasil. Oh, that's the Amulet of Yggdrasil, okay. Set bonus increases the damage of all Kratos ranged attacks and abilities based on his cooldowns. Okay. But we do not have more right now, right? So it can... Doesn't matter where we put it, we don't have any more uh, amulets and the rest is broken, needs to be fixed. Alright. Holy crap, there's a lot of stuff that we can do. Holy crap. Root of I the problem. Myself again. Nithurk. I do not know why a creature such as this would be so devoted to guard, uh, um, to guardian the roots of a tree, but she gave her life in their defense. Odin exploited Nithurk's purpose, protecting the roots of the world tree. To guard the curse he placed upon Freya. Oh, that's so fucked up, man. It's so fucked up. That's a thing that Odin would do, sure. Um, to use an otherwise innocent being's nature to lead it to, to destruction is a vile practice. I do not regret slaying Nithurk to gain Freya's freedom. But how many others are in the unwitting service of Odin? How many more will lie dead because of it? Yeah. We don't know yet. I suppose it's time to face my brother. And after that? I don't know. Frozen flame. Nice. For the Leviathan X. Another upgrade. Do we finally have also a heavy attack? We still don't have a heavy attack also. Like what? It's been a long time. So guys, that was uh, the story of how we freed Freya from her curse. And she forgave us for now, <laughs> I, I guess, for now. <laughs> no, but um, yeah, we did that and killed Nithok. Nithok. However you want to pronounce it. Um, the Guardian of the World Tree. And I don't know how good or bad that is. Because this might also be... Um, maybe our home is not safe anymore because of that. Who knows? I don't think that uh, Nithurk somehow uh, was capable of um, shooting off Odin from uh, the World Tree. But maybe he was. Who knows? We will find out. But until then, thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you liked the video. And of course, subscribe to the channel. And if you want to see any of this live... Come over to Twitch uh, on Monday, Tuesday, Thursday and Friday, somewhere around 5 p.m. I will be live then and watch all of this live when it happens and see me rage because all of the stuff uh, I usually cut out when I just rage or don't say anything at all. <laughs> but yeah, you guys have a good one and until the next one. Bye bye.